आई एम नासिर अहमद असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ फिजिक्स गवर्नमेंट कॉलेज फॉर वुमेन चिंतामणी तो टुडे विल बी डिस्कसिंग बीएससी पेपर फिजिक्स अंडर द टाइटल एस्ट्रोफिजिक्स सॉलिड स्टेट फिजिक्स एंड सेमी कंडक्टर फिजिक्स एंड कंटेंट्स ऑफ दिस वीडियो आर एक्सप्रेशन फॉर फॉर मी एनर्जी एट एब्जोल्यूट जीरो एंड एक्सप्रेशन फॉर एवरेज काइनेटिक एनर्जी ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एट एब्जोल्यूट जीरो so to derive an expression for fermi energy at absolute zero which we write it as e f of zero so fermi energy is defined as the energy of the topmost field energy level in the ground state of n electron system at absolute zero so we know that for electrons in a metal energy according to schrodinger's wave equation is given by e is equal to n square h square divided by 8 ml square in terms of h cross square it is written as n square pi square h cross square divided by 2 ml square where n square is equal to nx square plus ny square plus nz square so now we write nx square plus ny square plus nz square as equal to some r where r is the radius of the sphere then the expression for energy is given by e is equal to r square pi square h cross square divided by 2 ml square so in fact here nx square plus ny square plus nz square is equal to r square so that r is equal to square root of 2 ml square divided by pi square h cross square into e so the number of allowed energy states is given by volume of the space between two octant shells of radius r and r plus dr times the number of points per unit cell this is equal to 1 by 8 times 4 by 3 pi r cube into 1 which is equal to pi r cube divided by 6 since each state since each state has two spins the number of electrons n is equal to 2 times pi r cube by 6 which is pi r cube by 3 or the number of electrons is equal to pi by 3 times 2 m L square e divided by pi square h cross square whole power three by two, or n is equal to p divided by three pi square times two m e by h cross square whole power three by two, where l cube is written as v, the volume of the solid. Therefore, e is equal to h cross square by two m times three pi square n by v whole power two by three. Since the density of electrons small n is equal to number of electrons. capital n divided by per unit volume of the metal ef of 0 is equal to h cross square by 2 m times 3 pi square n whole power 2 by 3 or the fermi energy at absolute 0 ef of 0 is equal to 3.65 into 10 to the power minus 19 times n to the power 2 by 3 ev here we get this value 3.65 into 10 to the power of minus 19 just by substituting the value of h cross square m and pi square so we see that fermi energy depends on the free electron concentration of the metals only its value generally ranges between 1 ev to 10 ev in metals therefore the average value of fermi energy can be taken as 5 ev to calculate the free electron concentration using fermi energy from the above equation we see that the free electron concentration capital n is equal to 4.53 into 10 to the power of 27 times ef to the power 3 by 2 where ef must always be substituted in ev so next is an expression for the average energy of the electron gas at absolute zero So average kinetic energy per electron at absolute zero is the total energy divided by the number of electrons. So mathematically, it is written as average energy E zero represents energy at absolute zero, and the brackets represents that it is average energy is equal to one by n integration zero to E f E n of E d E. but n of e de is equal to g of e into f of e is the number of filled states in the energy range de 
but for e less than e f we know that fermi dirac distribution function f of e is equal to 1 and the value of g of e the density of states is equal to v divided by 2 pi square times 2 m by h cross square whole power 3 by 2 e power half d e and also from the earlier expression for fermi energy we know n is equal to v by 3 pi square times 2 m e f of 0 by h cross square whole power 3 by 2 so substituting the values of g of e and the value of n in the above e in the equation number 1 of this expression and integrating it between 0 to e f we get the value of the average kinetic energy at absolute 0 as e 0 is equal to under the brackets is equal to 3 by 5 e f of 0 thank you